Hey, welcome back everybody. The Accidental Survivor here. And we're back with a relook, um, more like a second look, at Deadly Flare. Even though I've done two series on this game, <clears throat> none of the series went more than, you know, seven or eight episodes. And um, this, there's been an update to the game. A large update came out, and I wanted to check it out. We're on version 3.0. And uh, th even though I started or I, I hit my load game, they started me back in the bunker. So um, I immediately, when checking, noticed that they updated uh, some of the uh, mechanisms in the game. So my, I have an energy, carbs, proteins, fats, thirst, vitamins. I also noticed that they gave me a helmet, a flashlight, a compass already, <clears throat> and they expanded my inventory. Where before, you know, I had a lot of spaces that were empty like this, and I was talking about finding backpacks and you know, maybe you can upgrade. Well, they started me off with the extra space already. They gave me a bunch of ammo, three med kits, some food, some pills. <clears throat> and uh, we're going to look around and see what else I can get. It looks like some empty cans here. No, nope, can't take them. But I got a pistol. I got my ammo again. I got another compass. So I don't know if that's a new one or... Hold on. All right, so I did have an extra one. So let's get rid of that one. So I do have a compass on me. What is this? Oh, I got a canteen. So I got two canteens full of water. Okay. We got cloth. Let's go ahead and take that. I know that was important last time. I have a knife. Another med kit. Okay. So we've got three med kits, four med kits. Uh, my inventory is already full. Um, but I needed the knife. <clears throat> I see they started me with a handsaw. And uh, I've already got a, I've already got a shotgun. Oh, that's freaking awesome! Let me reload that. <clears throat> and I got bandages. Looks like I got a spear already. No, wait. You know, I'm wondering. Okay, hold on. I don't think they started me with that stuff. I think that was stuff that I had. They just started me back in the bunker because I had that sl uh, steel hammer. You know, I had found that. Um, so they're not really starting me. They may be starting me over again, but a lot of my items that I had on my person, it looks like I was able to keep. So I've got additional stuff like that compass and another canteen. Okay, you can equip weapons by dragging them to the slot and pressing the related button. Okay, so it looks like, yeah, they definitely started me over. It's too bad you can't get back into here once you leave. But I got my shotgun. I also have... Uh, the new pistol that I picked up. Make sure that's reloaded. Wait, oh, I got no ammo for it. Okay. And I got my regular pistol. Let's load that up. <clears throat> Maybe it'll free up some space in my inventory. It did. I freed up one spot. And my shotguns. So, yeah. I got... Okay, I got a bunch of shotgun. So, they've, there's been updates to the game, obviously. And uh, I'm kind of curious to see what kind of improvements they made. Uh... On the version 3.0, they, they advertise like a dog. Like, I don't know if that means like a dog companion or there's dogs in the game. So let's see what we got here. All right, we need all that stuff. Uh, oh, actually, I have an engine. Is that... Why is it showing yellow? Because I got an engine battery, gas can. I got four tires on here. Can I get in this thing and just drive it? I can. All right, so I got my vehicle back without having to do all the parts. Now, the base may be gone. I don't know. I also don't know if there's more infected in here or the zombies or if the loot came back. So we're going to take a look real quick just to see if any of this stuff came back. I'm not even seeing any icons to search stuff. Oh, here it is. Interact. Is that the sink? Oh, you got to search separately. Oh, press E to faster opening. Okay, so I got some stuff out of here. I got some food. Can I stack that? And I got a toolkit. So you have to press E. Oh, damn it. Okay. So all the stuff came back. They, they changed the mechanism for searching. So now you, it's not just... You know, the dot. You have to eat it, interact, and then you have to search. Before I would just open the container up. <clears throat> and we'll see what they got. Another flashlight. All right. I hope, the, hope that stuff stays there. What I want to do right now is I want to run back to my... To my uh, that little cabin that I was working on. And see if that's still intact. 
And I wonder if they added more stuff to the... You know, to the game as far as, like, uh, locations. There's the mine. Go to the house. Go to the log house. Okay. So that did not... Wait, that's in a different spot, I think. Go to the log house. Why is it over there? Yeah, that's in a different spot. How far away is that? 300 meters? I wonder if that's over where the bandit camp was. That's what it's looking like. Uh, or no, 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 it's in the same spot. Okay. Yeah, it's the same spot. I'm not going to do any base building, uh, this second look, just because I'm curious, uh, what else the game has to offer in the update. Um, is that, is that the cabin I built, or is that, no, never mind. <laughs> I am not rebuilding all that crap again. Not in this uh, limited time I have for this uh, episode. Alright, yeah, all this stuff came crashing down. Got nails, I'm not going to take any of that. Damn, all my containers are gone. Let me look at the trunk of this vehicle to see if stuff is still in here. No, but look at a storage space in there. Holy crap. Wow, I got uh, finally, you know, they got more than like six things you can put in the trunk of a vehicle. So let's take uh, let's take some of this extra stuff out. Uh, I don't need the extra med kit. Let's get the saw out. Um, let's get the cloth out. I'll hold on to the knife. I'll hold on to the ammo. I'll take the empty can away. Uh, I'll hold, yeah, I'll hold on to the lighter. So I have, I have a pistol in my inventory, and then I have another one here. So let's get that one extra one out. Man, I got lots of room in there. That's, that's one new thing. There's no map. But let me see, um, which one was the compass again? That was number seven? Yeah. So, okay, um, I got mine. What is that? Starting area. Straight start. I can't read that because of the numbers. Military zone, tra trader's camp. Dude, we're going to go to the trader's camp. 1,200 meters. I was not aware there's traders in the game now. So I'll definitely want to. Oh, still doing, still spinning tires. I see. <laughs> yeah, Trader Zone. I did not know that they. Had, if they added traders, this game definitely got more interesting. Where was that at? Okay, we got thousand. I was fairly close to it where I started. I want to be able to drive that bus around. <laughs> You know, let's follow the road for now. So I think it takes me around. Start. There's the starting area. Okay, I'm Trader's Camp. I think I, I I'm not gonna go up over top of that mountain. I'm gonna go I'm gonna follow the road around. I haven't seen any zombies. Oh they got me yeah, they got me back on day one. Even though I was like a day from uh getting the second wave, I think. <clears throat> or so. Wait, where the hell is that trader's camp? Hold on. meters. We're going off-road. I gotta find that. And I don't know how far around the road goes. Damn it. I'm gonna... I'm gonna get this vehicle stuck.
I don't know if this area was here before and they just added this. I don't remember seeing a trader's camp. Oh, look at this. Yeah, I'm sure there's a road here. I watch it before the bandits and they come rushing out here. Freaking shoot me. Alright, trader's camp. There's guys in the towers. Um, I guess we're going to find out if they freaking kill me. He's up there looking. Oh, we got a guy at the gate. Is he following me? Damn it, I got a guy following me. Oh, okay. <laughs> I say, you make sure I ain't shooting. Oh, look at all the stuff, man. They got pumpkins. I grew like a cabbage, but I was trying to find other seeds and stuff. So it looks like you may be able to buy these kind of items in order to survive. Man, that's awesome that they have a place like this. I'm glad they incorporated that. Here we go. We got somebody right here. Let's see here. I get a meat sample. Materials needed. Uh, coins. You can use this coin to buy goods at this trader camp. Okay. Now, what if I have... Um, this dirty pistol. Okay. What is she standing around? What is she staring at? Like staring up into the sky. Like, ah. Uh, okay. <laughs> so what does this need? Um, so. Does that say mo most sample? Meat sample? Missing materials. The hell do I find that at? Is there other trade? Oh, there's another trader here. Maybe this guy buys stuff. Okay, I can buy car parts from him, including gas. Tires. All right. Is there a weapons trade? Oh, we do have a weapons trader. And a dog. He's got some big eyelashes. <laughs> All right. Uh. Oh, you can buy the dog for 20 coins. This dog can be used as a companion, but needs to be taken care of. Where's the weapons trader? There's, like, nobody here. Damn. Yeah, this guy's, like, the medical. Maybe he does both. I don't know. So we got uh meat sample. What? Okay, I wanted to see what that if that would show up, what that was. Is there any other traders here? I see another building. Can't get inside. All right, still empty there. Okay, well, we got traders. Looks like they may have one here for the garden eventually. You can buy seeds. I wonder if I can get in here and get away from the, uh, on the horde night. All right, that's kind of neat. We got a, uh, we got traders. I, I, I don't understand how I maybe could sell stuff. It looks like I got to find stuff to barter with. You know, bring back like that meat sample or whatever they were talking about. And then I can get coins, and with those coins I can buy other things. But I think, is that the only... Or maybe they want coins for that meat sample? I don't, I don't know. So here's the road. Let's, let's follow the road this time and see where it goes to. It goes right here to this uh, road. Let's go to this military zone. Let's see how far away that is. zone that I um, I think it is let's get out yeah it's, it's the same one let's see if they added anything here now I have not seen many zombies so uh, I don't know if they tweaked it 
Oh, uh, never mind. Oh, I didn't get my pistol out. Hold on. Uh, let's get that back into my inventory. Three ammo. Crap. Damn it, I can't hit that dude. Here they come. Damn, look at them all. Okay. Oh my god. All right, there's a lot of them. Oh, they're over here too. All right, let's get up here. Maybe I can get up on the tank again. See, they, I don't know if they can get me up here. Damn, look at them all. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to kill all of them. Damn. I wanted to see if any of this stuff had changed. Damn, look at them all. Damn, I can't freaking kill these guys. <laughs> Alright, let's go with the uh, shotgun. Oh, the animation for the shotgun shell I see is a little screwy. It's like a square. <laughs> It's a square surrounding the shell. Take the legs off. He's still not dead? Alright, now he's dead. Alright, I wanted to uh, check this place out and I don't want to have to kill or fight all these freaking zombies on the ground. So, they're all taken care of. Now we can take a look around. Because I know the last time I came through here... Yeah, here we go. We got, like, ammo and stuff up here. <sighs> 357. Oh, I got a 357. Let's take that. What is my ammo? Oh, I got plenty of room in my inventory. It looks like there's shotgun shells here. <sighs> oh, I could be wrong. Yep, 12 gauge. Is that more 357? <sighs> At least it looks like they color coordinated it now. Okay, 45 rounds. Yeah, there was like ammo and guns galore here. Uh, I'm going to leave that alone. Now, over here at this little practice range, I remember seeing a couple guns in the past. Yeah, there would be like one here, but that doesn't, doesn't mean there has to be a gun there. Got tires. Don't need that. They got fuel cans, but I don't know. I think those are just like uh, for for you know background decoration. <sighs> All right, let me look over here real quick. <clears throat> I think that's the ammo that they have. Uh, it's always been like that. Other times I've come here. What the hell is this? Oh, those are lockers. <sighs> you know, they had all the uh, ammo uh, over on this side. You know, over here. And over here, there wasn't really much of anything. <sighs> uh, it does... It has changed a bit, because I remember standing on this truck. Or a, a truck like that. They may have made this a little bit bigger. Oh, here we go. 
Oh, I thought it was a gun. Some more ammo there. I wonder if you can get inside these tents. No. This one you can. I'm stuck in the freaking tent. Okay. And we're back outside. Oh, they added this new entryway, it looks like. it's They, they redid the entry here a little bit different, I think. I could have been wrong. It could have been here before, and I just didn't notice it. Because I think before I went around this way. <clears throat> what is that floating in the air? Oh, it's a lantern. Okay, I'll take that. All right, before we wrap this uh, relook up of Deadly Flare, I'd like to go hit a bandit <sighs> camp up and see what's changed with those guys. And uh, so I'll go to a known bandit camp that I can get to. I haven't seen any other animals yet either. Like, I haven't seen any wolves. Um, I know they're here, so I'm not, uh, I'm not wishing for one. I'm just observing that none have come at me yet. Okay, it's getting later in the day. Oh, what am I doing? So let's go, let's go to the, my vehicle just died. All right, what am I missing? Uh, gas. Okay. I suppose a little bit of gas. And maybe the tires. Um, let's get that back in here. Hold on to that lantern for now. All right. I guess uh, we're not going to make it to the bandit camp. Because that is a little ways away, and on foot it'll be freaking dark. It may have been dark before I got there. I don't know. Because it's, uh, yeah, it's going 7 o'clock at night in the game. So how, did this mechanics change on this? Okay, you still got to search. Uh, you got to do the new search technique. Which does take time. Now, I can press E, and it'll open up quicker. So I got more pills. Um, I already got a knife, so I'll leave that alone. Now, while searching, you can press E, and it makes it super quick. So you can uh, do that. Let me swap these out. Hold on. Oh, I thought I could unload, but... Maybe not. This is probably empty. One night. Oh, it's got one round. Okay. So let's get rid of this one. Definitely getting darker. Vehicle battery. Okay. All right. I don't think I'm going to make it to the bandit camp before it gets dark, and then it'll be problems trying to see. Uh, there's something over here. Let's hit this up real quick. That looks like it may be the trader outpost. Oh, there's something. Oh, this is that farmland. This is that farm. This looks... Oh, no, wait a minute. What the hell is this? Oh, oh, okay. It's one of these areas. Look at all the zombies. Alright, we dealt with zombies already. There's definitely a lot more of them than there used to be. Now it's dark. And here they come. And I hear wolves. Yeah, that's like a trailer park. I think that's what they call that one. Let me bring out the uh, compass. And I'll take a look. Yep, trailer park. Gas station, buildings. Mine, farm. There's a motel 250 meters this way. One of the motels had bandits. Uh, so maybe we can find them real quick. Over this way. I'm not going to stop and search all these cars. I'm not going to worry about trying to get my car fixed again. Uh, like I said, I'm not doing an ongoing series of this right now. But I, like I said before, I would come back from time to time to check out any new updates. And there's a new update. So here we go. 
There may be... I don't, I don't know that there's bandits here. But just in case, let's get the pistol out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think I've been here before. I don't know that there's... Yeah, like I said, I don't think there's bandits here. Just a motel. Probably a bunch of zombies. Yep. All right. He's in the building. Yeah, these guys don't, like, stop freaking chasing you. Okay, yeah, I've been here before. All right, I think I'm just going to uh, wrap this uh, this relook up for Deadly Flare. Um, it's been interesting. I, I would actually like to check out more of this with the new additions. Um, it's definitely a great addition, you know, to the game where they added traders and stuff. Uh, it opened it up a little bit more. And I just wish you could be able to sell items that you find. You know, stuff hopefully will, like, respawn in the world over time. And I'm hoping you can take items you find and sell them for coins and then buy stuff you need, like um, car parts or you buy the animal companion or buy food so I'm not, like, starving to death or buy seeds to make your own garden. That, w that would be nice. But uh, anyway, until, uh, until next time, guys, I do want to thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next episode.